Have you ever heard somebody say that jump is as big as a house? Well, this is my house and I'm going to jump it on my bike. We've got a really long run up to the house. It's a little bit bumpy, but the perfect towing vehicle, which has 300 horsepower, weighs 800 kilos, and that makes it rapid. <laughs> I'm going to put my ramp here and then jump all the way up to here, right down that tiled roof, 11 meters in the air, through that valley, and then a big drop off the end of the house all the way down to there. But there's one problem. This chimney is completely in the way. Like this is exactly where I need to land. So I'm gonna have to be inch perfect to just miss it and not collide with the world's gnarliest chimney breast. The first job is build the ramp. It looks mega. That is the biggest ramp I've ever built by far. We've measured from the top of the takeoff to the ridge of the landing and it's 12 meters. I mean, it's resting against my house. Can you imagine what the postman's gonna think? But the next job, I guess, is build the landing. Well, a lot's changed since the last time we were up on this roof. Half the house is now rideable, which is amazing. I can't stress how big that gap is. That scares me, terrifies me. The chimney is still in the way, but now this is rideable, I can practice the second half of this project, which is the drop. This drop is so cool. I mean, flying off the end of my house with that, I don't know how much speed, there's gonna be so much speed. No brakes, let's see where I land. Let's do it. Woo! Bigger! 3.2 meters. 3.2 meters. Whoa. 3.4. 4.3 meters. One, two, three, four. 5.6 meters to the back, but the sweet spot's probably more like seven, 23 feet. Wow. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get much bigger than this. One. Oh my God. That was still one pedal and a big pump. So that's it, we've now got to move some trees and a fence. What do you think? It's quite good. Go 38 mile an hour okay. and try and hold it there, yeah? yeah? It's gotta be fast enough. I can't afford to come up short. That's so fast to hit a ramp. Yes, boy. I don't think it's much faster than that to clear it. We need a big landing. This is the last day with the scaffolding in place, so I've got a few more attempts to ramp up the speed and then it all comes down and gets way more dangerous. Finally cleared it completely at 43 miles an hour, which was a massive step up from the first practice attempt. We did 36, 38, 40, 41, 42, 43, and now the scaffolding's down. The whole thing looks way more scary and way more gnarly, but I have to do it. The whole point was to do it without the scaffolding. I'm really nervous, but it's the moment of truth. 43 miles an hour. Let's do this. Let's have it. too far we could jump the whole house 